We're back again with the infamous USB no leaf air condition fan. I want to see if we can make this at least semi functional. I think the problem is that the blade is rotating in the wrong direction. Right now it rotates in this direction. And if you look at the way the blades are on the wheel, it really should be going in this direction. And since this is a Derrick current motor, it likely is very easily reversed. So let's see if we can open this up and change the direction of the airflow. I'm sure it will probably still be a completely useless and ridiculous product afterwards, but at least uh, at least my curiosity will be satisfied. Okay, so uh, I'm not sure what the chances are of aggregating this back together correctly. <laughs> it's already an issue. It looks like that was completely pinched on assembly. Surprised that wire didn't even just break. That's ridiculous. All right, so it's pretty simple. It's just two two wires. So, just out of curiosity, let's see how it runs. Oh man. Oh wow, it actually moves a pretty considerable amount of air when it's not all blocked up by that stupid frame. Because this is pretty much like a basic, um, you know, blower wheel fan. This is all covered on the bottom here, and so all the air is getting forced out the top up here so I mean the fan itself isn't terrible it's moving a pretty good amount of air by itself it's just the stupid housing was never destined to work I don't know. oh I guess that's for batteries all right um, you know what in fact the easiest way to reverse it is just to, to get some batteries and put them in backwards I got some batteries, so I guess we'll just go ahead and put this back together then, and we'll use the batteries. Half of the screws stayed in there. I'm not going to screw it together yet. Okay, so just by comparison, it's kind of difficult to get those batteries in there. Okay, it's not really doing anything. Typical. Let's reverse the batteries, which is generally something one should never do. I'm not sure if it's going to really make a connection or not. I don't think it's going to. We have to. Uh, Put some wire in there or something. Yeah, it's not making a connection on that side. Get a piece of wire jam in there or something. Let's see here. I'll just take a piece of uh, Romex here. And I think this should be enough to make contact. Yeah, that'll work. Well, it would have worked if the batteries weren't flying out. Oh, 
I may need to do it on the other side as well. Yeah, that's it's gonna have the same issue on the other side, so I'm just going to cut two pieces of this. half it just has to work okay so now the fin should be moving in the what I would consider to be the correct direction which it is it certainly sounds different Feels to me like it's moving a little bit more here. Nothing considerable. It's not a considerable difference, but well, I guess maybe it is a considerable difference. At least now it's lifting the paper off the table. Let's see what it feels like opened up. Oh, the battery compartment is not going to work. Opened up. Well, let's see if I can make it work. All I got to do is take take this piece out of here and move it. Is that not working? I would think that that should be making it operate. it's not working. I don't understand why it's not working. Did it just break? Hmm. Well, for some reason the batteries isn't making a good connection. Well, I'm just going to swap the leads then. Huh, the strip a lot easier than I thought they would. I think that should work. Let's see what transpires. Oh, 
Well, now the uh, air is coming out differently, but definitely with a lot more force. Yeah, it's, it's definitely moving more air now. So the, half the problem with this thing is that the uh, the motor runs backwards. That's just unacceptable.